Welcome to Byte Further. In today's video, you'll learn what to do when your iPhone 7 won't erase all content and settings. A factory reset makes sense when the phone is malfunctioning or you plan to sell it or trade it in. It can be easily done by going to the Settings app and tapping Erase All Content and Settings. Though, the option should crop up sometimes and fail to work, then your iPhone 7 won't erase finally. Nothing happens after a passcode is entered to confirm the erase but a circle keeps spinning. When it comes to why your iPhone 7 is not erasing, there are a few possible factors. No internet connection, wrong passcode, no SIM card, low battery, activated Find My Feature, software glitch, iOS error, Apple server unresponsive, hardware damage, and so on. Now, follow the steps to rule out and troubleshoot these causes one by one until iPhone 7 lets you erase all content and settings. Don't forget to give this video a like or a super thanks if you think this video is good and helps. Now, let's start. Step 1. Check basics to erase all content and settings on iPhone 7. A successful factory reset process relies on a stable internet and enough battery power. So, first of all, Make sure your iPhone 7 connects to a Wi-Fi network with full signals or has stable cellular data. Second, plug it into a power source. Third, check if the SIM card is inserted and placed properly. If you can't erase iPhone 7 as it tells you that the Find My feature is enabled, just go to Settings, tap your name, choose Find My, tap Find My iPhone, and tap to turn it off by entering the Apple ID password. When all is done, Go to Settings app and tap Erase All Content and Settings option to see if it works and starts erasing the phone this time. Step 2. Perform a forced restart. Sometimes, there might be a system lag leading to iPhone 7 Erase All Content and Settings not working. For that, just go and force restart the device to refresh the system. Here's what you need to do. Press and hold both the volume down key and power key until an Apple logo pops up from your iPhone 7 screen. After the device turns back on, try to erase all data again through the Settings app. If it still fails and tapping the Erase All Content and Settings option is completely unresponsive, move to the next step. Step 3. Install the latest iOS on iPhone 7. Try to update the device. It's possible that the newly released iOS brings a fix to the Erase All Content and Settings not working on iPhone 7 issues. Here's what you need to do. Go to the Settings app. Tap General. Choose Software Update. If the screen shows the latest iOS firmware available to download and install, tap it and update the phone. If it says your iPhone 7 OS is up to date, you might need to try other ways to erase data on the device. Step 4. Use a computer to erase an iPhone 7. There are several alternative ways when the Erase All Content and Settings option is not working on iPhone 7. One of them is using a computer and iTunes. To make sure the restore process goes smoothly, it's advised to put your iPhone 7 into recovery mode first. It's an official troubleshooting mode, which is safe and won't damage the phone. Here's what you need to do. Head to the computer and open the iTunes application. You can also use the Apple Devices app, or if you have a Mac with Mac OS Catalina 10.15 or newer, use the Finder software instead. Next, plug your iPhone 7 into the computer and press some buttons. Press and hold both the volume down button and power button until the recovery mode screen pops up. It'll display a black screen with a laptop, a cable and a link. Then, pay attention to the computer and the application window. After detecting your iPhone 7, it should pop up a dialog box showing the update and restore option. As your iPhone 7 won't erase content and settings, click the restore option. After you complete all the on-screen instructions, it'll trigger the restore process, which might take at least one hour to finish. During the restore process, if you find the phone exits recovery mode itself and the restore stops, just repeat the steps to put it back and continue. Once done, your iPhone 7 should be restored to its factory defaults. Step 5. Remotely erase iPhone 7 in iCloud. Another way to factory reset an iPhone 7 when erase all content and settings does not work is relying on iCloud's Find My feature. As long as the Find My feature is enabled, you can use the Erase function in the Find My section to erase everything on your iPhone 7. Better still, it can be easily done through a browser. Here's what you need to do. Open a browser, be it Google or any other browsers you prefer. Type and go to iCloud.com. 
Enter the Apple ID and password correctly to log in. Once done, find and click the Find My option. Then, from the devices list, choose your iPhone 7 where tapping Erase All Content and Settings doesn't work. Next, choose Erase This iPhone, select Erase again to confirm and finish the on-screen steps until the erase process starts. Once done, your iPhone 7 or iPhone 7 Plus will boot up and show the very beginning hello screen with everything erased. Step 6. Get official support. If none of the above steps work to erase all data on iPhone 7, contact Apple if there's a problem with the server failing to respond to the erase command. Besides, it may be possible that the device has a hardware issue and needs servicing. So, you can contact the official support online or make an appointment to visit the store in person. That's all for how to fix an iPhone 7 or iPhone 7 Plus that won't erase all data. If you find this video helpful, please buy a super thanks for this video and give this video a like. Your support means a lot to us to deliver more useful videos to help those in need. Also, if you have any further questions, feel free to write them down in the comments below and I'll reply ASAP. To learn more tech tips about iPhones, subscribe to the Byte Further channel. Now, you can click another video on the screen to keep watching.